To travel is to leave home, is to dress like a madman, saying everything and nothing with a postcard, is to sleep in another bed, feel that the time is short. To travel is to come back. Gabriel Garcia Marquez. The universe has a unique way of revealing itself to us. We need to have our eyes and ears constantly open because often the revelation comes as quickly as it goes. When we are young, it's easy to get frustrated, to doubt ourselves in the midst of uncertainty. But know this, everything is going to be all right. Before leaving Mexico, I started a travel journal and wrote a manifesto based on something I once read. And now that this wonderful experience working together at Casa Bossi is coming to an end, I wanted to share it with you, hoping it gives you strength to keep loving, sharing, and discovering the world. Love. Love with incredible foolishness. I'm not just talking about a partner, though that's great too. I'm talking about life. Assume the best in people. The goodness, the light in this world, is so much stronger than the darkness. Walk into each day with optimism. Life often has us think of ourselves and others as wicked, but in reality, we are all just a bunch of normal people who stumble, fall, and hopefully get back up. If you meet the world with a loving heart, I'm sure it's how the world would meet you in response. Travel. Say fuck you to the culture that says two weeks of vacation is enough time. Don't be afraid to take time off, time for yourself, because when you venture into the world, you wake up to life. It awakens your senses and invokes a deep sense of realness in your soul. You feel alive and all at once connected with humanity in an authentic way, despite feeling a disconnect of language or whatever else. If only we all travel more, we will understand that it's not just about how similar we are as human beings. No, it's much more complex. It's also about differences, beautiful differences that hopefully light a flame of curiosity in your heart. Celebrate difference and return to similarities. We are alike when it matters, regardless the culture, the age, the political philosophies and the religion. But it's our differences that make this world fun and difficult to live in. Seek out people who are different than you and share your unique identity with the world around you. Listen to other people's stories. Ours are societies that have survived on story. If you travel with incredible love and passion, you'll encounter stories that yearn to be told. Listen to the stories that you find and bring them back with you. Embrace the art of storytelling. There will always be places to travel and the stories we hear and then tell shape our souls and determine what it means to love. Be as patient with yourself as you are with other people. You're still figuring stuff out and to that I say, hallelujah. You are full of love and you are love. Rest assured that this is the greatest truth and take it into the world. The world needs loving hearts, analytical minds, and curious souls. That's the trifecta, and you got all three, even if you don't realize it yet. I love you guys, you inspire me. <laughs>